Some things in life are just made to go together. Peanut butter and jelly, rock and roll, the sun and the moon. These things got Blake Sanders, the owner of KS Services, thinking. What can we pair with our superior heating and air service to make our customers even happier? Plumbing Experts by KS Services was born. So the next time you have a clogged line, leaky faucet, or water running all through the house, know there's a reputable company out there on call just a click away. Call KS.com, your trusted source for heating and cooling and now plumbing. It's the Weather Extreme video for Saturday, June 20th, 2020. I'm Scott Martin. Summertime starts today at 4.44 p.m. Central Daylight Time, and Mother Nature is going to be sure we know it. Very little relief from the heat in the way of rain for the weekend, but rain chances will be on the rise as we approach midweek. We'll get to that in just a moment. I will be heading out of town bright and early on Saturday morning, so I am producing the video on Friday night. No hazards for central Alabama as of 10.50 p.m. Friday night, but we do see that a severe thunderstorm warning was in effect for portions of a few counties in the southeastern parts of Georgia. Flash flood warnings are up for portions of North Carolina due to the near continuous rainfall they have seen over the past week. No severe storms are expected on Saturday, but a few thunderstorms may be possible near to the Georgia state line. No severe storms are expected on Sunday as well, but a few thunderstorms are possible over the northern parts of the area. Projected rainfall amounts through the end of the next week show that we may have a widespread of totals across the area, ranging from as small as just over one quarter of an inch to as high as two inches. We'll see how that goes with the coverage, especially on Tuesday through Thursday. All right, let's jump to the forecast for the weekend and next week. We'll start off with the 18Z run of the GFS valid at 4 p.m. Saturday. The first day of summer will feel like summer. Saturday will be a hot day with a mix of sun and clouds. While just about all of central Alabama will stay dry, a few locations may see a brief isolated shower, especially in the eastern parts of the area. Afternoon highs will be in the lower to mid 90s. Other than the location of a few brief isolated afternoon showers, Sunday will be a near carbon copy of Saturday. Partly cloudy and hot with a very slight chance of isolated afternoon showers, mainly over the northwestern parts of the area. Highs will be in the lower to mid 90s. Rain chances will be on the rise for the first half of the work week as a trough deepens over the eastern half of the country. Monday will feature mostly clear to partly cloudy skies with a chance of scattered mainly afternoon storms. Afternoon highs will be in the lower to mid 90s. Tuesday will feature more clouds and rain chances becoming likely as scattered to numerous storms will be possible mainly during the afternoon and evening hours. Afternoon highs will be in the upper 80s to the lower 90s. Wednesday will feature mostly cloudy skies with scattered to numerous storms becoming likely once again during the main heating of the day and into the evening hours as what looks like a front will try to push through much of the area. Afternoon highs will be in the lower to the upper 80s. That front looks to continue to slowly move through the southern parts of the area on Thursday, keeping rain chances elevated, but not quite as high as the previous two days. Skies will range from mostly sunny to partly cloudy across the area from northwest to southeast, and highs will top out in the mid to upper 80s. Friday looks to be a much drier day at this point with a mix of sun and clouds. I can't completely rule out a few isolated to scattered afternoon storms, but chances look to be much less than just one day earlier. Afternoon highs will be in the mid-80s to the lower 90s. A disturbance that is located off the southeastern U.S. Atlantic coast poses no threat to the mainland as it is expected to move off to the northeast. There is a very minuscule risk that it may start to form some tropical characteristics on Sunday, but cooler waters will shunt any further development after that. The rest of the Atlantic Basin remains quiet. That will wrap it up for today's Weather Extreme video. We'll have notes on the blog throughout the day. Bill Murray will have the next video out on Sunday morning. I'm Scott Martin signing off for today. Have a great day and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.